Thank you for choosing Wendy. How can I get started for you? Would you like to see what that's made? No, thank you. I'm pretty depressed. I'm sorry? I'm pretty depressed. Oh, why? All right, guys, I just filled the tank up. I'm seconds away from jumping on the highway. My goal is to uh, arrive in Nashville tonight. It's cold, it's 33 degrees, 8.20 p.m. Let's go. Oh yeah, here we go. I made it to Kentucky. All right, so I'm a little bit embarrassed about this, but I had to pull over out of Love's gas station because I need to rest about an hour and a half into my trip. I almost drove off the road about 10 times in the last five minutes. So I just, I didn't want to, but I had to make the smart decision. I'm going to rest here for about 30 minutes and uh, hopefully get back on the road. All right, so it's 45 minutes later. I feel pretty refreshed. I'm ready to get back on the road and kick some ass. <laughs> Hey guys, I arrived here in Nashville. Hey, I originally was going to go to a hotel, but I uh, just like, casually uh, stumbled into this uh, Kroger parking lot. I don't think the Kroger is actually open, but from what I can tell is it's a really nice neighborhood here and um, I just get good vibes from this particular location. So um, I'm gonna brush my teeth, which I'll do right now and uh, get my sleeping bag ready. Sleep about eight good hours. All right, so I'm parked, I'm ready to sleep. The car's heated up. I like this spot because while Kroger is closed, there are many cars in the parking lot because these are the workers of the third shift. So, you know, I kind of blend in, hopefully. There are a few cars back here where I'm at, but uh, yeah, so I think it's, I think it's gonna work out pretty good. Happy holidays. Hey, I'm back in the car, <laughs> temporarily. I gotta do what I gotta do. Uh, good night. Good night, everybody. It ain't me, baby. No, no, no. It ain't me, baby. It ain't me you're looking for. It's 10.30 a.m. I'm cold, cold. Can't feel my limbs, but I'm getting up. I got to get back on the road. Hell of a lot more people than last night. Hey, the funniest part about this, look at this one. <laughs> Tank is on E, so I had to get off the road here. It kind of looks like I'm in a bad area. Uh, I like these areas. It gives me the opportunity to fight somebody, which I haven't done in a long time. This is really interesting. It looks like they're building some rabbit tunnels, like some homes for rabbits. Yeah, I just got off the road for a minute here in the middle of nowhere, and uh, is this cotton here? Sure does appear to be cotton. I'm gonna, I guess I'll grab one to see if it's soft. Yeah, that's cotton. Everybody's all right. I'm here in Dallas. I've been driving all day. I'm ready to go to sleep. Just about two hours ago, I started having my first doubts about all of this. I was fighting to not to turn around and go home. <laughs> That's the truth, you know, it's just right now I'm having a lot of doubts. It's pretty sunny here. It's uh, it's kind of hot. It feels good. I'm, I had to roll the windows down. Uh, I just woke up literally 20 seconds ago. Um, yeah, I'm on the way to Austin right now. Wait, in about two minutes. 
I roll up this sleeping bag, and I'll be on the road. It's 64 degrees here. About to put my swim trunks on. Stretching my knees, I think I just grew about two inches. Woo! I just stopped off here at racetrack. I got uh, got two bulls, red bulls here. And here's what I want to show you guys. I got this. There was like three people in there. <laughs> three people in there saying, "Oh, this is really good. It's legit." <laughs> It's a, a stuffed pizza wedge. <laughs> Look, basically it's like a, uh, it's like a piece of pizza, but it's like encased in, in bread and so, I don't know, I'll try it. It's not bad. It tastes like a hot pocket, to be honest with you. This is legit. All right, so I'm here. I got here, uh, it's 3.40. I'm about to walk in there. I was instructed to come through these uh, crumb doors over here. I don't know if you can see them, but um, I'll be back in a few minutes. Yeah. Oh, it's right over here. Did somebody tell you that? You're lying for waiting. It was a quick process. They said uh, I'll be able to start once I get a call within uh, you know a one to two week time frame. So it's 72 degrees here. It feels perfect. Right now, it's probably gonna drop pretty low tonight. We'll see. Uh, this is my first time in Austin. I don't know what to think yet. I haven't really got to travel it around too much, the suburbs and whatnot, because I've been driving so much the last two or three days. But I'm excited to see what comes up. You know, my, my next goal is to really start this job and, and try to find a place to live. Um, that could, you know, that could be a week or two. Um, but hey, hang in there with me. If you, if you like this video, subscribe, and uh, I'll be posting videos pretty regularly, at least uh, pertaining to the uh, the USPS job. If you're interested in working for the USPS, this job might help you. I'm going to explain everything about the job, my experience with it, and um, hey, this was fun. See you guys. Good night, everyone.